Hi, I'm Holly Johnson. I'm a local hat maker and business owner at Hojo Hattery. I make handmade hats from scratch using a traditional technique called felt blocking, which is something that Newcastle under Lyme uh, has been known for since the 17th century. And there used to actually be hat shops around the town centre where you could go in and you could watch the hat makers work. So I'm super excited to be doing the Newcastle Common Artist Residency uh, with Appetite Stoke and Newcastle Bid and for that I'm going to be researching and exploring the history of hat fashion uh, and just the history of hat making in general uh, in Newcastle under Lyme. So I'm appealing for anybody that's grown up in Newcastle under Lyme or if your family has grown up in Newcastle to send in any photos, any memories, experiences that you have. Uh, I want photos of people in hats, what hats did you wear growing up, what hats did your family members like to wear, uh, do you remember any hat making shops? If not, what businesses do you remember growing up? Uh, what memories did you have growing up here and of the businesses? Uh, and you can send in any of this information or photos to hojohattery at gmail.com or you can find me at hojohattery on Facebook or Instagram. So send these in and I'm going to take all of that inspiration uh, and I'm going to be making two classic hats based on uh, all of these photos and these experiences and I'm going to be making videos that will be released every Wednesday starting the 3rd of February so you can see how I make these hats and what I'm doing with the inspiration that you've sent me and then at the end uh, of the project at the start of March I will be doing a live stream from a shop front in Newcastle and I'll be making a contemporary hat with uh, pyrography designs on that are inspired by things that you've sent in and during the live stream you'll be able to ask me questions you'll be able to talk to me and I will answer those for you during the stream. I can't wait to see what you all send in and I'm really excited to get started on the project.